healthy. He's healthy. Um, and, and I know he warmed up really good, throwing the ball really well. You know, it's just like you got to. He's got to get out there and just, you know, almost, you know, not think in terms of not throwing the ball, but just trusting, like trusting it and and letting it rip, and then uh, let the let the results fall where they may. Where I think he's guarding against, like making sure he doesn't throw a ball and that's you know similar to the mindset I talk a lot about hitters you know like well I want to get a hit I want to go and, and that gets you in trouble you know maybe a little bit similar on the mound but no I think he's healthy and um, you know his last few couple of I know bullpen sessions and talking to Hark about his warm up he was really sharp actually so we just got to get him over that hump Aaron, it's 10 to 2 at that point is there any thought to letting him work his way through that, or is it the point no. where you know if he grows one, you get a grand slam on his ten to six? Yeah, no, I, no, no. I, I don't want him out there in labor, and labor, and especially first time out. You know, he's up at twenty pitches all of a sudden there, and it's just like, no, don't want to mess with it at that point. Are you concerned at all about his mindset? He seemed to spe- like kind of defeated as he walked off the mound. He didn't even wait for you. Right. That was unusual to see that. I, I mean, that's the biggest thing. No, I mean, I. <clears throat> I know he wants it, and I know, you know, the good thing is, like I said, I feel like his work and his sides and everything's been really good, so it's in there. Um, you know, I, but I think, you know, there's probably a little bit of confidence right now uh, that's not there, especially, you know, when, when Chappie's at his best. He's a mother out there. You know, he's a, he's, he's, he's. He's got all, a lot of confidence, and we got to get, get that back to him. So that's the biggest thing right now because I do feel like he's healthy and, and you know, the work is there, um, but it's getting over that hump, and I think confidence plays a big factor in that. It looked like Marinaccio talked to a trainer after he came off. Is he all right? Yeah, we'll see. He's, he was a little dead arm today, so we'll, we'll see what we have there. Overall, just what did you think of Cole this afternoon? I thought he was good. Um, you know, they're they're a good contact team, and they're and they're pretty patient. Um, so you know, they did a good job of laying off some close pitches. You know, so they made him work um, quite a bit. I thought his fastball was really good today, um, and really just the, you know the two mistakes, and really you know Naylor hit the cutter, looked like up and out over the plate, and then falling behind Reyes, and then getting a getting a you know three up one three zero pitch out over the plate there. So other than that, um, I thought he was pretty sharp. I thought their team did a pretty good job of making it tough on him and laying off of you know those close pitches that you know sometimes you see chases on they do a pretty good job of that but I thought Garrett was good. Marinaccio comes into a situation there and gets three outs in a row and it, if you get a couple hits there it could be a game and you look at what he's done lately I think he's given up running 14 15 outings in a row hasn't given up a hit in 11 in a row what can you say about the job that he did today and overall in the last month or so? Yeah he's he's he's, he's he has done a good job I mean that you know that change up's really good obviously makes him really tough against left handers um but yeah, he is he has earned more and more of a role and taken advantage of some opportunities. Um, you know, like like that's been one of the cool things with with all our young pitchers this year, whether it's King going to that another level and what we've seen out of Sears and Marinaccio and Clark Schmidt. You know, those things have all been really encouraging, and uh, you know, certainly certainly Marinaccio is right there.